Hello there, I'm the hypothalamus. I'm part of the endocrine system and I'm located under the thalamus of the brain. I link to the nervous system to regulate bristle activities. I'm also the size of a pea. I'm the part of the brain that's responsible for homeostasis. Homeostasis is the maintenance of your body. Things like heart rate, body temperature, thirst, hunger, and sleepiness. I work with a pituitary gland that produces hormones that enable us to maintain all these things. These are all important conditions and strenuous activities, like working out. Factors such as blood pressure, body temperature, fluid and electrolyte balance, and body weight are held to a precise value called the set point. The hypothalamus sends out nerve signals to various muscles, often through the autonomic nervous system. For example, in response to cardiovascular exercises, the hypothalamus takes control and tells the adrenal glands to release adrenaline, which tells the heart to beat faster and the skeletal muscles to tense. Here, follow me. Anna, you're thirsty. You need to take a break. Hey guys, I think I need to get a drink of water. I'll be right back. Okay. Jenna, your blood pressure is really high. You need to take a break. My heart's racing. I need to take a break. Weak. David, you're really just pushing yourself. You really need to take a break. No, no, I got this. I right, dig deep. I got. Just relax and don't move. <sighs> the lateral hypothalamic nucleus increases arterial pressure and heart rate. The posterior hypothalamic nucleus and preoptic nucleus decreases them. I basically regulate your heart rate. When I detect that you lack water, I send a message to the pituitary gland which releases the anti diuretic hormone, or ADH. This travels in the blood to your kidneys and affects the tubules so more water and electrolytes are reabsorbed into your blood. As a result, you make a smaller volume of more concentrated urine. The level of electrolytes and water in your blood increases until it is back to normal. Fluids like Gatorade can really help. Here, watch this. David, get up. Come on, man, I ain't got all day. Hurry up, man. Oh. <sighs> Fluids like Gatorade have a lot of electrolytes and water that can replenish your system and make you feel rejuvenated. And drink it, man. You thirsty? Yeah, fill those electrolytes up. Yeah, like mm. that fluid. Mm. Yeah, homeostasis at its finest. Man, it's working. Electrolytes. 
Yeah. Like them electrolytes, man. Mm. Electrolytes. I told you. Man. Alright, check this out. You guys got to see. Um, Alright, you see those kids over there? You see that sun? Alright, well that sun's light is making these bodies really hot. And as a hypothalamus, I maintain homeostasis by also regulating body temperature as well. Now, when that sun makes these bodies too hot, I tell the sweat glands to secrete to cool these bodies down. Come on, let's go tell these bodies that they're hot. Man, that sun is right directly over these guys. You guys are hot. Yeah, it's really hot. Like, can we go inside, please? Oh, it's hot. Please. It is really hot. hot. Good thing I always have my thermometer handy. Check our temperatures. All right. All right. All right. All right. Must All right. be hot. Oh, wow, I'm pretty hot. Oh, really? Like, wow. like, wow. Dude, dude. All right, Hannah, let's, we're, let's we're check your like temperature. Out here. Uh, uh, I'll put it. Okay. All right, now watch this. Hannah, start sweating. Here, let me put it Aside from these functions, I also control hunger, cravings, and tell the body when it's full. Oh, oh what oh, look at that! What's up, boy? Can you see this boy in a minute? This is the pituitary gland. I'm the pituitary gland, and also Hannah's brother. This guy and I work really hard together. He creates hormones that promote cell growth. I was just telling these guys about how I control hunger, cravings. Yo, I'm gonna stop you there, bro. All right. You see, the hypothalamus also controls hunger and body weight with its set point. When body weight goes below the set point, the lateral hypothalamus is activated and hunger is increased. When body weight goes above the set point, the ventromedial nucleus is activated and appetite is decreased. As the hypothalamus regulates hunger in one's body, you see, this regulation directly correlates to the control of movement and glandular secretion of the stomach and intestines. The stomach receives a signal from the hypothalamus when levels of nutrients in the blood are low. This signal causes the stomach to contract. This movement in the stomach is what tells the person they are hungry. The paraventricular hypothalamus is responsible for our cravings, while the ventromedial hypothalamus is responsible for telling us to stop eating. As the food moves through the stomach to the intestines, certain hormones are released to the ventromedial hypothalamus, which tells us to stop consuming food. That's it. That's me. Let's go find some kids that are full. That was really hard. Like, I didn't understand, like, anything. Yeah, like, so, teach it to us. Like, someone was like, oh, okay, I get this. But then, like, the fill in the blanks were like, Yeah, like, what's uh, like, it's a black like, I'm glad I did not the have a shade. Blanks. Yeah, I was like, this wasn't even like, I didn't even know what we were talking about. Dude, it wasn't even the book. Oh, wait, so wait, wait, bad. guys, you know the project he just had like two days ago? What was our topic in, again? It was uh, hypo, hypothalamus, hypothalamus. Oh, yeah, hypothalamus. I read something about that yesterday. It said that the hypothalamus is the size of a pea. <laughs> and just a pea. Are you serious? Yes. Yes. It gets so slight. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. I heard this, dude. Okay, the hypothalamus controls the four Fs. Fighting, fleeing, feeding, and mating. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you, 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 I don't get it. I don't get it. Are you serious? That's... Yeah, wait, what does it mean? Wait. You know what? Just, 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 just it's, don't it's fine. Just don't worry about yeah. it, Hannah. Alright, alright, I got one. I got all one. Right, this right, one's right, really funny. This one's this one's kind of funny. This one's kind of funny. So if you remove the hypothalamus out of a rat's brain, it would keep eating until it like blows up. Like it's gonna be like really fat. It looks like a carpet. Like the hypothalamus is pretty lame, right? Is that the joke? Uh, yeah. No, no. That, that's that's. Funny. I'm not that lame. You're full. You're full. And you're full. You're all full. Yeah. I'm, I'm done. I'm, I'm done. Let's get out of here. Okay. I'm good. Yeah. I'm powerful. Back and Yeah. I'm not that lame. <laughs> hey, pituitary gland. Hey, Rush. They're dreaming. Oh. Bye bye. 
See, one of my other functions is to control sleep. <sighs> I'm gonna go pee. Go back to sleep. The hypothalamus serves as a sensor for the sleep switch. The mechanism can be triggered by changes in factors such as the body's fatigue. The ventral lateral preoptic nucleus, or the VLPO, of the hypothalamus is responsible for shutting down the brain's arousal signals. These neurons connect directly to arousal promoting centers and shut them down to promote sleep. Transitions between wakefulness and tiredness often occur in just seconds. Good night. Finally, the hypothalamus controls the anterior pituitary gland's hormone secretion. As the hypothalamus releases and inhibits hormones, they are directly carried to the anterior pituitary gland. The release of a hormone, somatostatin, inhibits the secretion of growth hormone in the anterior pituitary gland. This growth hormone is necessary for cell division and cell growth. The neurotransmitter dopamine is also released to inhibit the secretion of the anterior pituitary hormone, prolactin. This hormone is important to sustain a woman's milk production. As we can see, the hypothalamus plays an important role in hormone control and development.